Potato leafhopper is often the most abundant and damaging insect pest in northeastern alfalfa crops. Feeding damage stunts the growth of both newly established and regrowing alfalfa plants by robbing them of nutrients. Potato leafhopper's toxic saliva further stunts plants' development and discolors foliage. Unable to overwinter in the north, they migrate from the south each spring on wind currents and weather systems. And because southern populations of potato leafhopper are active before northern crops begin their development, we'll want to begin scouting our alfalfa fields shortly after the plants start growing in spring. To scout your field, use a standard 15-inch diameter insect sweep net. While walking forward, make 10 broad sweeps, one with each step. When you've completed your 10 sweeps, quickly close the net to trap everything inside. Slowly open it, counting every adult and nymph. Adults are quick to jump out and fly away, so keep a sharp eye. Nymphs are tiny, but fairly easy to see due to their neon green coloration and calm sideways habit of walking. Record this number and repeat the sweeping and counting process at least three to five more times in other parts of the field. Add up the total number of leafhoppers and divide that number by the total number of sweeps. If you completed five sets of 10 sweeps, divide the total number of leafhoppers by 50 to get the average number of leafhoppers per sweep. Finally, measure the average height of the alfalfa stand. Use this action threshold chart to decide whether any control measures are necessary. For example, if your crop is an average of nine inches tall and you counted an average of 0.5 leafhoppers per sweep, you can avoid taking action at this time. But you'll want to scout again next week to make sure your crop is still under threshold. If your nine inch alfalfa has two leafhoppers per sweep, you should consider taking action to prevent yield loss. Contact your local extension agent if you need management recommendations.